Hi, I'm Jeremy Lucchini from SolarWorks, and I'm here on location at Abco Automation. These guys make packaging machines like the one you see right behind me. We're going to learn a little bit more about this company, meet some of the great engineers that work here, and learn a little bit about SolarWorks 2011. I'm Ed Penny with Abco Automation in Greensboro, North Carolina. We deliver factory automation solutions to our uh, manufacturing customers. We specialize in robotics, uh, assembly machines, uh, material handling, and liquid packaging systems. Uh, we have the engineering and manufacturing resources on site to deliver turnkey solutions. Place it and then go pick up the 1140 and come back okay. to the home position. Each machine is its own challenge. Uh, each machine is to be invented from scratch effectively. So it puts a lot of pressure on the design group to minimize that design window and to produce a machine that's um, both robust but also inexpensive for us to manufacture. We use SolidWorks from the initial stages of working with a customer. We'll develop uh, uh, concepts and models in SolidWorks to, to evaluate and to, uh, to show our customer. Our customers seem to really uh, embrace and enjoy evaluating those things and the it helps us close the sale. Now this is all existing, right? As a mechanical engineer using SolidWorks, we're involved in the quote process of developing a concept model that we can show the customer very, very quickly. We then take that model and refine it, design the assembly, design the process, design the piece parts. We then take those piece parts and develop detailed drawings that we get to the shop. The shop works with those drawings and takes them to the assembly shop where our 3D uh, isometric and exploded models are used on the shop floor to put the equipment together. Uh, all along the way, the customer can look over our shoulder and see what it is that we're doing, and they get more confidence in, in the, the design long before they see the equipment on the, on the floor. It's an intelligent software. It's not just a couple of lines put together on a drawing. Everything is parametric, all our models are connected to the drawings. And being able to move the robot inside the 3D model, we definitely know uh, from the very beginning we have enough room. We can design everything in the smallest detail. It wouldn't have been possible without a software of this caliber. We're a relatively vertically integrated company since we do everything from design to manufacture and assembly in one house. So tying all that together through the enterprise PDM software is very critical. Helps us with revision control, helps us to have a confidence that the drawings that are on the shop floor are the correct drawings that we should be building to. If we can design parts that work with our processes and work with our unique capabilities, then that allows us to turn out a quality product much faster and much more economically. What I'm most excited about in inside was 2011, it would be the D feature. We can eliminate features we don't need, we still can keep the motion we need to use, and we definitely reduce the size of the file, plus the, even the rebuild time will be less. Enhancements in uh, drawing detailing, like automatic spacing, that's interesting, saves time, more the productivity and I really uh, barely expect to see the memory management. That's definitely something I'm looking forward to. It seems like SolidWorks 2011 was really designed for us and released for us. Uh, every machine we design has a large welded frame, it has tons of vendor data that we really want to de-feature and we really want to simplify. Uh, and with these large machines, the, the increased memory management will really help us work more efficiently and, and have the confidence that we can work throughout the day and uh, have that stability throughout the course of our day. We can work with more things at the same time. It's definitely an improvement. One of the things we've been talking with SolidWorks over the years is to ensure that that reliability is in place, ensure that that software stability is in place. And I'm, I'm very encouraged to see all the work that's been done towards that end. Ultimately, it will make my engineers more productive, so it's going to make ABCO more productive and ABCO more profitable, which is my main concern on a daily basis. I'm excited about 2011. I really think that SolidWorks has been listening to the users and has really built a product that we can make use of, and I I'm, I'm, can't wait to get it on my desk.